And as the new year begins, Nigerians have urged the federal government to ameliorate the sufferings of the masses in 2024, as the outgone year was bedeviled by trying times for the nation. And this was the major submission of parishioners at the Catholic Church of the Assumption in Koi, Lagos, during the crossover mass to usher in the new year. Correspondent Uyime Elijah reports. The mass starts with worship and renditions of beautiful hymns. <laughs> The parishioners at the Catholic Church of the Assumption solemnly prays for good tidings this new year. The parish priest, Very Reverend Father Francis, who took part of his homily from Numbers chapter 6, verse 24 to 26, urged Nigerians to move closer to God in the new year. He said it is the way to regain the lost glory as a nation and get better economic prospects. We have every reason to rejoice and give thanks to God. And so I pray for you, despite the emphasis of failure of government in the areas of economy, education, health, social welfare, especially in the areas gave of security. I pray that God will protect all of us. Reverend Francis said, for people to experience a new beginning, they must be willing to follow God completely and serve him in truth and spirit. It reminds us that we are nothing, and we do not own our own life. And whatever thing we do, whatever plans we have, whatever project, let us put God in our project. In light of this, Plus TV News spoke to some Nigerians about their expectations for Nigeria in 2024. They reviewed key areas that need improvement for the good of the citizens. 2024, I believe, is to be a very great year for all of us. God has been very faithful to us in 2023. Nigeria will be blessed. The citizen will be better. Things will go well. The government will do well. For peace in Nigeria and what people have passed through in 2023 may they never pass through it in 2024. We believe things are going to be better for us. We hope for good Nigeria and uh, a better Nigeria. In all, Nigerians were advised not only to pray for their leaders but also work with them towards attaining an indivisible and prosperous nation. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.